Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Google's big AI focused keynote at Google I slash O on May 14, 2024. They are still working on projects like Gemini. As Google keeps integrating more AI into its search, you'll soon be able to ask longer, more complex questions and see results neatly organized by AI. If you want a more traditional search experience or simply prefer less personalized results, we've got you covered. In today's video, we'll show you how to turn off AI features in Google search. Let's get started! What is the web filter in Google search? But wait, before you dive in, you've got to know about the web filter in Google search. When you switch to the web filter it changes your search results. It basically strips out all the media stuff no images, no videos, no Google news sections. You'll just see straight up links. Some of those links might lead you to YouTube videos or news stories, but you're only seeing the links themselves. Cool right? How to turn off Google AI? Alright let's jump into the topic. How to disable AI in Google search. With all these new AI features rolling out, Google also added some options to help you avoid AI if that's what you prefer. First off there's a new button at the top of the search results page called web. It's easy to miss but super useful. When you switch to it Google will only show you text links from websites. We've actually talked about this web filter before. It's kind of funny you have to click a button called web to get regular web search results. But hey if you want to dodge AI this feature is perfect. You'll only see top results from trusted websites. This web filter is now available for both desktop and mobile searches globally. If you don't see it at the top check under the more menu. Here's some good news for those of you who aren't fans of AI search, Google has confirmed to The Verge that the web filter will stay, even as they add more AI features to the home page. Just a heads up though the web filter isn't the default setting. You'll need to switch to it manually each time just like switching to image or map filters. And to be clear, Google hasn't given us a way to completely turn off AI search on the default page. Maybe someday we'll see a Chrome extension for that, but for now, switching to web filters is the best way to avoid AI in your Google searches. And that's it! You've successfully turned off AI features in Google search. Now you can enjoy a more traditional browsing experience. If you found this video helpful don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching! Do you like AI in Google search? Share your thoughts in the comments below. See you in the next video.